Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to Warhammer 40,000 Armageddon. So we're at the end of the first mission here. Everything's been done. We just need to hit end mission, and we'll move on to the next one. Nothing really to say, so let's go. Thank you, Commander. I'll ensure your intelligence is reported to Regimental Command for analysis. Other reports filtering in are not good. The Orcs have taken High Vulcan. We don't understand how. The defenses should have held for weeks. Command is currently reviewing the other hives to ensure we don't lose any more. Why has the Emperor abandoned us? Stand by for further mission parameters. In the meantime, you're tasked with bolstering the defense of Deathmire. Finally, Commander, I have a chance to talk to you. I know you have been occupied coordinating the defense of the Hive City, but as the senior member of the Officio Prefectus attached to this unit, I feel it my duty to make my thoughts known. While other battalions attack the orcs head-on at the behest of Governor von Straub, we sit on our hands waiting for the Xenos filth to strike. Raven acts like this will not read well in my report. Wow, that guy's kind of a dick. Um, I guess he's a commissar, it's kind of his job. What can we do? We can tell him to concentrate on the moral fiber of the men, or we can tell him he's an idiot. Well, he's kind of a dick, so I'm going to tell him he's an idiot. Strategy and avoiding combat can be dangerous to similar I will be keeping a close eye. I note that the communications adjunct you seem so fond of has relayed as a possible orc site. The greenskins are massing close by. I trust you have no objections to a pre-exit strike. That honestly seems kind of unwise, considering we still aren't 100% sure what's going on. Oh. This is the map we were just in? It is, but it's been extended out a little bit. Oh, huh, cool. Okay, uh, scenario objective. Capture four victory hexes and then await new orders. Alright, so we're in... Yeah, this is the map we were just on, but it's been, uh... It's been extended out this way a little bit. So I guess we're... Where are we even going? We're going back this way? Towards the hive? That seems weird. Um... Anyways, we've got our troops, but... We should get some new ones. Yeah, we should definitely get some new ones. So, um, this right here is points we can use to buy new troops. Which we can do? Yeah, purchase. Okay, so we've got all... Oh my god, we've got all of this stuff available. Ugh, I can't see what units I have, though. Um, we should definitely get a new company command unit. Because we lost that. So I'll get one of these with a... Wow. Get one of these with a chimera, thank you. That's actually a decent amount of points. Um, I don't know if we have any more... Okay, we've got three slots left. Let's get another unit of regular infantry. So you can't go wrong with regular infantry. And I quite like having them. Here we go. So we've got a little, pretty nice infantry company set up there. Now let's focus on our armored forces. We should get more standard Lehman Russes, I think. They have a bit more versatility. Uh, oh my god. All of the Lehman Russ variants. Okay, so let's see. We've got the regular one. The upgrade one has, you'll note, the guns on the side. Those are machine guns. Sort of. It's, you know, Warhammer 40k machine guns. They fire mini rockets. They're really kind of silly. I can get an armor upgraded one. Ooh. Um, a dozer blade for clearing minefields. One with better spawns and mount guns. Those are the side guns. This is the anti- or the sort of anti-tank one. The light anti-tank one. Um, this is the... Uh, Conquerors are, I think, the, like, standard pattern-ish. Yeah, they have the, like, tread guards for a little bit of extra armor, but they don't have, you know, any of the serious upgrades, and they're still using the regular gun. Um, Demolisher is a siege tank. Eradicator. This one's got a big-ass plasma gun on it, if I remember correctly. Yeah. So that's for, you know, when you just want to remove things that look at you funny. Execution. Oh, no, this is the plasma cannon. What is this one? What is the Nova cannon? I can't remember. Exterminator, it's got two auto cannons, so it's good against kind of light vehicles or heavy infantry. Punisher's got a freaking Gatling gun on it, in case you need to get rid of a lot of infantry really fast. Vanquisher's got the big ol' anti-tank gun on it, you'll see the long barrel. Um, so we could get that. This is a dedicated tank hunter, with a laser, big ass laser cannon on it. This is what I'm not familiar with, it looks like an assault gun. Uh, I think I'm going to pick up a Conqueror for right now. I think that should probably 
Actually, I'm going to get one of the upgraded Lehman Russes, because I like the... I like having the heavy bolters on the sides. I think they're useful against orcs. Let's grab one of those. There we go. And I should be able to upgrade this one, I think. Can I? Yeah, there it is. Upgrade. Upgrade you. There we go. And this thing, this thing honestly doesn't seem very useful. Um, can I upgrade this into a basilisk? I can. I'm going to do that. There we go. Two basilisks, I think, is better. And I think we've still got slots left, right? Yeah, we've got one slot left. Ooh, <gasps> aircraft? Ooh. That seems like it'd be really useful for scouting. Or I could get more sentinels. Hmm. Mm hmm, hmm. Decisions, decisions. I'm gonna go with sentinels. Grab that, and we'll upgrade our current sentinel. Armageddon pattern is basically the same, they just got more armor on them. They got a fully enclosed cabin, because the atmosphere of Armageddon, the planet, is uh, super toxic. Which is why all the troops are wearing gas masks. Now, our objective is to capture these four points, it looks like. Hmm. If we get some armor up there, be able to rain hell down on there. Uh, I'm going to send... Where's my... These things are all named with numbers, which is kind of annoying. Um, I guess, you know, if you have any ideas for unit names that you want, just throw them in the comments and I'll, I'll take a look at them. Um, I'm really shit at coming up with names. So let's... We'll send the infantry up here? We'll send some of the infantry up there, at least. Hmm. How do I want to split these up? Alright. I think I'll put the tanks down here so they can engage anything that's over there. So let's put you can go here. Then you can go there. You can go there. I will send the sentinels up the... the sentinels can go up here with... I'll send the one of the infantry platoons and the flamethrower platoon. I'll go up there, try and clear that out. Keep the basilisks here. They're gonna have range on whatever. Uh, I'm gonna actually put the salamander over here. And he's going to drive up here and see if he can get a look at what's going on. And then the rest of the infantry are going to be over here, ready to move up with the tanks. There we go. There we go. There we go. Okay. So that's all my units deployed. Let's do this. Oh, wow. The orcs are, like, right there. Okay. Well, let's uh, hit them with artillery first. Zoom in a little bit more so we can see this clearer. There we go. There we go. And these these guys, these are just Gretchens, right? They have, yeah, they have no range, so we can just peg them with fire from here. And Salamander can... Oh, looks like there's another way up over here. Alright, I'll send one of the infantry units up there. Yeah, I'll send the, the foot platoon or the rifle platoon up here. Try and get around up here. Oh, hello. There's a grot tank up there. Sentinels are gonna have to deal with that. Fortunately, they have decent anti-armor weapons. How much range does the flamethrower have? Oh, it's zero range. I have no idea how range works in this game. All right, well, before we move you guys in super close, let us shift this uh, infantry platoon up. There we go, we got rid of them. Now we can move the sentinels up. Get them into... Oh, hello. You guys can move up here. Aha! Now you can fire on things. Uh, I don't want to engage the tanks with my chimeras. That would be probably a mistake. So you can fire on those Gretchens. There we go. I'll move one of the basilisks up to over... Right here should be fine. Now for our other unit. Yeah, you can take this road. You can take this road. 
And you're going to go out in the open over here. There you go. And the infantry will follow behind in their chimeras, I suppose. Uh, may as well just shoot those guys while I can. There we go. Okay, I don't think... Oh, the basilisk, right. You're gonna go with these guys. Okay, is that everyone moved? Yep. What are the orcs gonna do? Oh dear. They are engaging my sentinels, and I do not really like that. Oh my god, that is a big thing over there. What is that? Squigoth with super lava. Oh, that's gonna need to be dealt with. Now, let's, uh... Oh my god, there's a couple of them. Alright. Rain some fire down on these assholes. Here we go. And if I move the sentinels up a little bit, is there cover here? There is sort of cover. Alright, let's focus on getting rid of those Gretchens first. You cannot advance any further, and you cannot hit anything. So how about we actually I want the flamethrowers to be closer to the front, but I can't just, like, swap their positions kind of annoyingly. So how about we shuffle you... Okay, I'm gonna move the sentinel over here, so he's in cover. The flamethrowers can move up there, and then the other infantry unit can replace the flamethrowers. And then everyone will have a range on things, which will be nice. Flamethrowers... Oh my god, that damage. Absolutely disgusting. work on those Gretchens. And I guess the Salamander will just hit that tank from back here. Fortunately, the tank doesn't seem super good at anti-armor. It seems to be, you know, equipped to deal with infantry, which I am not at all complaining about. Now, let's move up some more. Doesn't seem anything here. What is that? What is that good for? I can't really tell. I'm going to go for this thing, though, because I don't like it. Oh, it's got it's got a really heavy weapon, so it doesn't return fire when you shoot at it. It can only fire on its turn. Oh, neat. I do like that. Uh, let's try and get you up here as well. You should be able to get in range. There you go. And you have an anti-tank weapon. Pew! There you go. And we can set the heavy bolter team up here. Get some more fire on that guy. Ah, uh, he's... There we go. Alright, we got rid of that one. That's good. Let's move you up into cover. And you can't see anything. We can move you... I don't really want to move right up to those buildings just yet. Is there any cover there? No. Alright, so you're going to move up a little bit closer. And you... Getting cover over... Is that not cover? Really? That looks like it should be cover. Ah, well. Yeah, that's not cover. Oh, that's cover. That's weird. There's clearly, like, stuff there. Alright, whatever. Um, is that... Who am I? Oh, you. Okay, you can move to here. There we go. Think you've got some cover. Is that everybody? No? Who have I... Oh, my other basilisk. I forgot about him. Ah, that range on everything. Let's, uh, try and get rid of these big gun zap gun. Big gun cannon. Okay, well, we'll just focus on this one first, I guess. There we go. We knocked out one of the guns. Who who do I still need to move? Who did I not move? I don't know. That's... Okay, whatever. Oh, Jesus. The enemy, the enemy has brought some artillery of their own, unfortunately, and my flamethrower unit is getting... Uh, having not the best time of it. Can we get in cover here? Okay, this is cover. So you can move up a little bit. And let's fire on those tanks. And then you can also move up. Keep hitting those tanks. And the Earth Shaker. We're gonna keep hitting, we're gonna hit that squig. Smack, there we go. Basilisks, man. Basilisks are good. 
you can move. Here is the best cover, probably. Man, the gun on that salamander is amazing. What is that? It's, oh, it's an auto cannon. That's why auto cannons are really good. Okay. Well, we're gonna risk it. We're gonna move up. We're gonna flamethrower these assholes. Oh, that didn't get him. All right. Step up. Fire. Ah, damn it. That tank is so low. Okay, now our little uh, armored thrust here. We can actually move this heavy bolter team up, and they will still have cover. Fantastic. You guys. I should really. I can, oh, wait, no, I'll save the artillery. Because if I can get rid of it without using the artillery, then the artillery can do something else. And the tanks. The tanks can only really engage these Gretchens, so. Speaking of these Gretchens, uh, you guys are going to need to move closer. You guys, uh, they're going to need to leave cover to actually engage the Gretchens, but the Gretchens can't return fire anyway, so it's kind of irrelevant. Really? There's one Gretchen left? Dicks. Okay. Uh, yeah, you can move up a little bit. Alright, now I have basically my choice of targets here. Let's get rid of these guy. There you go. These these guy this guy. And then you can move into cover. There we go. And ah, you need to move still. You can shift up over here. Hopefully you can get line of sight on something else. And I think what is this over here? Oh, oh, that's my bunker. Hey, I get a little bunker. Neat. Oh dear. Oof. Alright, my turn again? Good, good. Uh, let's get rid of these tanks. There we go. Let's clear the way for our flamethrowers. And you cannot... Ah, damn it, I moved him too far away. You can't hit the tanks now. There we go. Okay, you... There's no cover there. That's kind of an issue. But I also need that point, so there you go. And the Sentinels. Ooh, you can move far. Yes. God, Armageddon Patent and Sentinels are really, really good. Uh, let's move you up. Is there anywhere here with cover? Not particularly. Alright, well, you're just gonna... Actually, you're not gonna move up, because I want the flamethrowers to get up close. You know, I'm, I'm kind of debating just ditching the flamethrowers. That I thought they would be really useful against orcs, but they don't seem to be. <laughs> You guys, actually, can you get rid of that tank? Oh, damn. Okay, well, hopefully this sentinel can get rid of that tank, at least. Ah, damn. Uh, we'll start to move. Oh, right, you guys. You guys are doing things. That is a lot of Gretchens. That is a lot of Gretchens. <laughs> you and move up a little bit same for you guys Personally, there's still there's no cover for me to fight these Gretchens from it's really annoying I'm just like fighting them from open ground fortunately they can't return fire but if something else shows up I'm gonna be like something with actual weapons I'm gonna be in trouble uh, you can wait there you can wait there what else we got you I guess shift a little bit along this way and the basilisk can come up here go. Oh, the infantry. Uh, you guys can actually wait there because you're in a really good spot right now. There you go. Oh god, those rockets. I gotta say, the AI takes their turns really, really quick in this game, which I, I very much appreciate. Uh, da, you. Get rid of that, please. Thank you. Sentinel. There we go. And then you can just step closer. Oh my god, these flamethrowers are so useless. There we go. Salamander gets the job done. And hit them with artillery, please. Thank you. I guess we'll move the flamethrowers closer, because why not? May as well get something out of it. You guys can no longer see targets. Good. 
unfortunately, that thing can't actually return fire. So we can just kind of sit here shooting it with things constantly. Alright, let's try and clear this point here. So, focus a bit of fire on these Gretchens. There we go. Excellent. Alright. So you guys can move into this building. You guys can move into this building. And we can move this tank up to join his friends. Okay, so we got two of the points. So we just need to get that one and that one. Shouldn't be too hard. Am I forgetting to move anyone? Or, you know, forgetting to do anything that I need to do. How about you come up over here and scout a little bit, eh? I don't think I need you up there anymore. Nope. Alright. There we go. Let's see what the orcs do. Uh, hi, Gretchens. Seems a bit rude. Okay. Now, time to pound these guys into dust as well. Yes. Okay. Alright, well, next turn I guess we'll have cleared them out. Oh, you already did the thing. Right. Forgot. Can we please scare to these guys? Oh my god. Will not die. Come on. There we go. Finally got it. Okay. Now we've got that point as well. And we can get rid of those guys. Fantastic. Uh, not really much else to do now. Oh, you can do things. Can you come down here and... Ah, damn, I was hoping they'd be able to get line of sight, but oh, they get... Man, Salamander's scout cars are really good. Oh, hello, actual orcs. Hmm, that's a concern. Orc forces on the ridge line have been destroyed, but more enemies spotted. We are cut off from the hive. Move at least five Steel Legion units to the far right of the map. Oh, okay, I guess we're just retreating now. Uh, huh. Oh, dear. Oh, my. Is it my turn now? No, it's still the orcs. Okay, that's weird. The AI is usually pretty quick about its turns, and that's kind of got me worried. There we go. Now it's my turn. Okay. Um, well, I guess time to get the hell out of here, then. Fortunately, ha 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 ha, my entire force is mechanized. Vroom. Okay, can you guys vroom? Yeah, you guys can vroom, but, uh... Do I want to take shots first? I mean, we can get rid of some of them, at least. There we go. You guys can get the hell out of here. You guys cannot get the hell out of here. That's an issue. Okay. Shuffle and... Scare those Gretchens, I guess. We are... I'm not... Uh, where do I... Where can I look at my objectives? Mission objectives. It still wants me to capture... That point. I'm thoroughly confused now. Am I actually supposed to, or am I just supposed to get units back? I don't know... I'm gonna move this guy over here just in case, and you guys are gonna reposition. How much range do these things have? One, two, and you guys have one, three on everything, so you're gonna park back here, and you are just gonna shoot the hell out of these orcs. Yep, there's a good parking spot. You have freaking five range. Uh, so you're gonna park, like, way, way back here, and we're just gonna focus on this one group of orcs here that's threatening our, uh, Steel Legion Infantry number two, as, as they are, uh, known by the locals. Is this... I think here's where I need to park. Let me get in range. There we go. We're wearing them down. Oh, my Salamander as well. Yay. I can't take points with that, though. Uh, I don't know where I want to park you. Just park you over here, I guess. And we'll just pull the Sentinels back. The Sentinels have done a pretty good job. I think we can uh, give them a break. Move the Earth Shaker over, though. You guys are definitely getting the hell out of here. You're just freaking almost dead already. Okay, we good? 
Everybody moved. Zoom out a little bit so I can see if I've forgotten anybody. Yeah, we seem good. Oh dear. That is a big orc tank. Skullhammer Battle Fortress. Oh dear. Yeah, I can see why I'm running away now. Pew, 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 pew. Yeah, that's a lot of orcs. Oof. Steel Legion Infantry number two is not doing so hot. Fortunately, they've got a ton of fire support backing them up. Mm. Jesus, I can see why their turn took so long now. I'm really concerned that I'm gonna, like, back up to the edge of the map and then the, game, the game's gonna be like, Oh, you failed the mission because you didn't capture four victory points, but I don't want to go for that victory point in case it's like, Oh, you didn't need to do that, now one of your units is dead. Because I like my units, especially Steel Legion Infantry number two. Look at those bastards. Uh, hi, orcs. Um, can you guys get out of there now? Yeah, you can. Okay, good. Whee! Goodbye. Ha 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 ha, mechanized forces are the best. Pew pew. Uh, yeah, let's just get rid of them. Can you actually... Yeah, none of you guys can hit anything from there. Or you can't hit them from there, so... May as well just... Shoot them and leave. Bye, 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 bye. Uh, I can't help but note the only, like, Imperial unit over here is this group of penal legionnaires. Um, so yeah, oh, you can hit them. Ha, 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 basilisks. Absolutely disgusting. Whee! Yeah, giving, giving all my units chimeras is probably the best choice ever. I'm waiting for there to be just, like, a bunch of orcs here. Ha! Ah. Ha! Ha! Great. That's just fantastic. Okay, what if we go up there instead? This way! Oh, why did I have to be right about that? Alright, I'm gonna hope that I can get up into that space there instead. So otherwise I'm gonna have to kill all these orcs. Okay, we good? We oh, my other my other uh, basilisk. Oh, he moves very slowly in this terrain. That is unfortunate. Everybody moved. Everybody moved. Yep, we're good. Okay, now for New York's super long turn. Zoom out a little bit so I can see what's happening better. It's gonna be a lot of nothing now because we can't actually see any of this. We'll just watch these penal legionnaires up here in the corner. Okay. I'm I'm honestly more confused that these orcs over here didn't do anything in that entire time. They just sat there watching my sentinel, I guess. Uh, can I shoot any of you without casualties? Yeah. And then you are gonna back up over here. You're gonna come over here. And the heavy bolter team. You guys have range, right? Yeah, one three. Fantastic. Fantastic. Keep getting the hell out of here. I swear to God, if there are orcs over here. God, fuck. Well, my flamethrowers are probably dead, for what that's worth. Alright, so I am in fact going to need to fight my way through the orcs to get out. Much to my annoyance. Freaking commissar telling me to advance into the orcs. Fortunately, because of my strategy of sitting slightly far away and shooting them with tanks, I didn't actually take all that much uh, damage in the first part of this mission. So I think we're going to be okay. It's just that my forces are now really strung out. Because I kind of made the mistake of just assuming the end zone would be clear there. Okay. There's the orcs continuing to try and take the hive. These poor penal legionnaires. Sorry, I keep trying to scroll the map away because I want to look at my forces, but... Oh, there goes them. Oh, now we're having a fight. Yeah, there go the flamethrowers. That is unfortunate. Okay, well, uh... N I don't actually know how many orcs are over there. New plan. I'm going to kill these guys. And then, hello. Death Dread with Kill Us All. 
Nice of you to join us. I'm going to kill these guys over here, because I don't like them. And then we're going to go across that bridge. Um, and part of this plan involves my sentinels shooting their tanks a lot. And you guys are going to move over here and engage the orcs, because you're running really low on health. Come on, people. Come on, people. There we go. Okay, so we got rid of that thing. War track or whatever it was called, I can't remember. Let's go, let's go. Let's, uh, shoot that thing, because fuck him. He's stupid enough to walk up to me and just sit outside his, his own range. He's melee, so, like, my tanks are just gonna... This one can't actually shoot him. Oh, because that's in the way and that's in the way. Um, but you... I don't actually know where to put you. If you move here, you can probably shoot him. There you go. Perfect. There we go. Uh, you're, I guess, just gonna leave. You guys are also just gonna leave. Broom! And the Elder Basilisk can maybe get in range of something? Yes! Please get rid of that tank. Thank you. Hmm. Okay, so this river is uncrossable, I guess. Come on. I, I, none of my infantry have moves left, so I can't see if they can cross it. Um, but we can move forward a little bit. There we go. Probably end our turn there. Now for the orcs' super long turn again. Okay. The orcs did not do anything, apparently. Interesting strategy, but whatever. Here we go. Here we go. Uh, my poor heavy bolter platoon. So weakened. Um, how about Sentinels, you go here, and actually, I can move the Earth Shakers up now. And try and get rid of that freaking Grot Tank, or Gretchen Tank, or it's called. Grot Tank, I was right. Get rid of that, and I've only got three turns left. I think we might have to be a little bit forceful here. As much as I don't particularly want to do that, because my guys are kind of... Well, if I use some requisition points, and I can just uh, refit them, right? Yeah. They'll lose a bit of XP, but they will gain strength. So you guys are going to refit. Cripes, they lose a lot of experience. Steel Legion Infantry number two. You guys, on the other hand, are just going to go across. And pick fights with people really unwisely. As is the way of the Imperial Guard. Let's try and get everybody across here. Tanks. Tanks. Ah. Uh, the problem with my tanks being, like, at the front is that they're now... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. My, uh, Lehman Rust there has caught himself in a little trap. It's unfortunate. But, oh, you guys can do things. Cool. Well, how about you? Come over here. There we go. That's what I like to see. Okay, so everybody moved? I think so. Okay, things are going not so great. Um, Lehman Rust Platoon number two has gotten it cut off over here, uh, which is unfortunate. And unfortunately, or double unfortunately, these guys move pretty fast, so I don't think I can just straight outrun them. Um, I guess I'll just try. <laughs> I don't really have any other options here. Which one of you is more threatening? Big Zappa, Scorches. I don't care about Scorches. Try and deal with the. Uh, that guy. He looks like he's got an anti-tank gun. Alright. Now, you guys need to go away. I do not like you. Thank you. You guys, move up. Uh, that's not a great fight for us. Try and get rid of that death dread there. go and uh, continue continue rolling across this bridge um, you move up a little bit here oh that sentinel platoon is also not in a good way hmm all right we just need to get across the bridge I think so what are these guys war boss oh uh oh 
That's not good. Let's just get you guys across here. And the Earth Shaker. Ah. Uh. Hmm. Heavy Bolter team is a little bit stuck now. Well, how about you guys get over here in the Chimera? Zero damage. Oh, you guys, right. Uh. I don't really want to take that fight. I'm just going to shoot at those guys instead. And you guys can move to here. And shoot the Gretchens. Yay! We don't need to fight the orcs where they're strongest. Oh no, my sentinels. Oh, this is actually getting pretty tense. And poor Lehman Rust upgraded platoon number two. Oh my god, he can... Better than nothing. There we go, he got rid of that guy. Okay, so we need to deal with these orcs. It's kind of the issue that I'm having. Please, uh, hit them. Thank you. Earth Strikers to move up. Oh, I moved them too close. Damn it. That's my mistake. Okay, there we go. And you guys. Oh my god, we can get rid of those orcs. Yes! Fantastic. Alright, you guys get across. Thank you. Uh, can these. Okay, these guys can get over here. Just fire their one chimera laser. Uh, I don't know if these guys are gonna be able to make it. I don't think they can even move far enough, because I think the mission ends on the next turn, and I don't think they're just gonna be able to make it here. Unfortunately. There we go. Okay, we're wearing them down a little bit better now. I'm gonna go move into cover over here, far away from them. And move the Sentinel up over here. Move the Basilisk to nowhere, because the Basilisk can't really go anywhere. Wow. Okay. Go over there, I guess. There we go. Oh my god, is the Rust Platoon number two actually gonna make it? It's kinda hard to tell. The orcs? I'm positioning themselves really weirdly, so they're not actually preventing me from. Oh, there's the cutoff. Okay. Yeah, no, Lehman Rust Platoon number two is kinda boned. Yep, yeah, there they go. They died. They died heroically. Oh. Okay, I guess I just won. I thought I'd, you know, have to go through the next turn as well, but whatever. Anyways, that was that. Wow, that mission went on for a while. Um, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all in the next episode. Goodbye.